Let's take a look at the generative AI powered slide generation tool that our AI team has been working on. First, we'll enter our topic, which today is UV rays. We'll select our grade, and we'll also enter our learning objective, which is the effect of UV rays on the human body. While the AI does its thing, let's talk a little about slideshows. Slideshows are one of the most popular ways teachers deliver lessons in the classroom. Teachers put a lot into finding quality images, appropriate content, and curriculum aligned information. That means first drafts can take a lot of time and attention. That's why our AI team has been working on this generative AI tool. It's fast, it's reliable, and best of all, it keeps the teacher in the loop with full control over the final lesson. Okay, now we see a recommended outline for the lesson. We have five high level topics, each with several supporting slides and suggested activities. We can review the topics and supporting points and make any changes that we'd like. It feels like we're missing a relevant topic here, so we can add that along with supporting slides. And we can drag and drop to get our new slides closer to the beginning. Now that we're happy with our outline, we can generate our first draft. Among other things, there are two big challenges we're tackling here. For starters, how do you ensure curriculum alignment? Different districts have different learning objectives, so our slide generation tool needs to align with those discrete objectives. The second challenge is, how do you get relevant images? Large language models can generate images, but there are some quality concerns. So our tool uses Bing Image Search to find the most relevant images. Okay, now we have our slideshow. As we get into the lesson, we can see attribution for the images the AI retrieved, and we can take a closer look if we'd like. We can review other recommended images, check the source, and replace the images from a selection of other recommendations. As we click through, we can see the other slides that the tool generated, along with activities to reinforce the lessons. As we get to the slides on the effect of UV rays on children, let's take a look at a key feature. If you're not happy with the content, you're able to regenerate it, and you can select or generate a new learning objective. Here are our choices. And once we make a selection, we can generate the new content. And of course, we're always in control, able to edit or add. Once again, selecting just the right image. When we have the presentation finalized, we can save as a PDF, we can save as a PowerPoint, or we can export to Google Slides. Stay tuned as our slide generation prototype develops and for more last mile solutions for education for Merlin Minds AI Labs team.